We want you to feel as prepared as possible for surgery. By understanding what to expect, you can feel safe and assured throughout your hospital stay and know how to maximise your recovery from surgery. Preparation is key for you and us. As part of your preparation for surgery, you'll be seen in pre-assessment clinic, usually with a nurse and then a physiotherapist or occupational therapist. The purpose of this is to make sure you're as fit as possible for surgery, so we need to understand your medical history and your current medications and maybe do some further tests so we can ensure we've taken this into consideration as part of your surgery. You will also be given information on anaesthetics and when to avoid eating and drinking prior to your surgery. On the run-up to surgery, one of the most important things to prepare yourselves is to eat a well-balanced diet. Your body needs adequate nutrition to help promote wound healing and repair. If you need any further information, please consult your GP or dietitian. As well as providing you with information about your operation, you'll also have the chance to practice using a walking aid usually crutches. We'll also get the chance to teach you your exercises. Practicing these before you come into hospital will really benefit you after your surgery. It's also important to prepare your home so that it's all ready for you when you come out of hospital. Our care team will help to advise you on this. These can include preparing your furniture so that it's at the right height or using adjustments or equipment such as toilet seat raisers. Clearing clutter out the way of places that you walk around frequently. Pick up loose rugs and watch out for small pets, both of which can pose a tripping hazard. If you can, store items that you use frequently within easy reach. Stock up your freezer with meals ahead of time, and if you can, speak to a neighbour or a friend or family member about doing grocery shopping for you. Alternatively, you can do internet shopping. And lastly, it's a good idea to have an easy to reach light beside your bed in case you need to get up at night. If you live by yourself, you might need some help for the first few weeks. If you can, try to arrange for a relative or a friend to come and stay with you for the first few days. You may be asked to arrive several hours prior to your operation. This is to carry out some final tests to ensure that you are safe to proceed with your surgery. During this time, you may be measured and fitted for anti-embolism stockings. This is to prevent blood clots forming and to promote good circulation. All of these tests are in place to ensure your procedure and recovery go as smoothly as possible. If you do have any questions about the procedure, however big or small, be sure to ask your surgeon or another member of the BMI Healthcare team. We're here to make you feel as comfortable and informed as possible.